And joining us now is John Brandon, New Jersey Knights of Columbus Motorcycle Ministry. John, thanks so much for being with us today. We really appreciate it. Father, it's been a pleasure, and also you, Jay. What are uh, some of the things that you've learned by being in this motorcycle rider group? What are some of the fun experiences you've probably had being a Knights of Columbus and in the motorcycle group? Well, the good thing is uh, we've had some really interesting things in the last year. Uh, the marriage rally that was at the Trenton uh, capital of the state of New Jersey, uh, the, we're not only a, a physical thing that people see, but we can be heard because of the sound of our motorcycles. <laughs> uh, we also escorted the Silver Rose uh, that was given to us from the state of New Jersey, and we escorted it all through the uh, state of New Jersey and was handed off to Pennsylvania. Uh, we just ran a poker run uh, to raise funds for the New Jersey State uh, Special Olympics. Uh, we have gone to the uh, First Presbyterian Church in Blairstown, New Jersey, to talk to children of a different faith that didn't believe in God. So we uh, talked them to them and uh, showed them the, the, the right light of uh, believing in, in our Lord. And we've done toy and fundraisers for the Edison Women's battered shelter last Christmas, and uh, we've got a lot more things that we're planning to do to uh, to evangelize as well as to uh, have fellowship. i got to tell you, John, you know, I, you know, one of the reasons why the, the Knights of Columbus are such a wonderful gift to the church is because their their guys and, and their wives and their families inserted into society. They bring their faith into the world and, and it seems like that's what you guys are doing because we have an image of a, of, of a guy on a bike and it seems like you are kind of turning that whole thing around. And that's exactly what we're trying to do. Mm -hmm. We just want people to know that bikers are people and most of them are doctors and lawyers and uh, priests and you name it and we're here to to lend that hand that we're part of a society that uh, is kind of overlooked, but we're good people, too. What is the bond like, John, with the whole group? <laughs> I'll tell you, it's the bond that we have as uh, motorcyclists, and not everybody in our group own motorcycles, by the way. <coughs> oh. uh, as you know, in the, our degrees, uh, one of them is unity. And if we broke it off and said only motorcyclists could join this, well, then we'd be going against our own... Uh, our own principle. So we have it so that anybody can join our motorcycle ministry, whether you have a uh, motorcycle or not. Um, and the bond is very tight. Uh, we're even tighter than the average uh, uh, council member. Uh, these guys have gone far and above anything that uh, Jimmy and I ever dreamed of uh, building up. You know, uh, I'm look, we're looking at a picture of you, John, while you're speaking, standing on the, the steps of the New Jersey State Capitol, the March for Life. Can you tell us about that event? Oh, uh, yes. That's an annual event, uh, as you know, about Roe versus Wade. And uh, as a, a knight, you also know that part of our job is to be that physical standing up, uh, you know, putting your money where your mouth is, so to speak. And I've been asked a few years in a row to... Uh, come and speak. Uh, there's a lot of high school and younger teens as well as young mothers, etc. And uh, I've been very fortunate that uh, I've been asked to come back year after year. Uh, the, the younger people seem to uh, be drawn to uh, motorcycles <laughs> and to, to speak on behalf of uh, the Knights themselves and what we stand for and for uh, life itself. Uh, so that's part of being a Knight and uh, that's part of the image that we want to make sure that the public also knows what's right and what's wrong. John, where can people learn more? Well, they can easily uh, go and see us at our website. Uh, we have a website, as you, I hope you have it there. We do. Okay, and uh, please, uh, we'd be more than happy, and we're looking to start other motorcycle ministries uh, throughout all of the United States, and hopefully we can move it into Canada and Mexico and all our other 
brotherhoods uh, throughout the world. Very good. www.njkofc.org. John, thanks so much for being with us, for the wonderful work that you and your group do. Keep it up. Thank you very much, Father, and thank you very much, Jay. Okay, John, God bless. Thank God, you so much. God bless. Yeah. Oh, they're doing a great job. I love that. I love the idea of that. And as a knight, that must be good for you. Oh, it is, because, you know, the knights are all about faith and family, unity as brothers and unity as a church, and bringing about uh, a greater awareness of incredibly important issues like the respect for the dignity of life from the first instant of conception until the moment of natural death. And I think John and his brothers are doing a marvelous job at that. Well, we'll have more of This is the Day right after this.